and what a view 4,800 over Northampton well it's the 5th of May or the 4th of May 4th of May I think and we're at Golden Ball and a load of people here and I'm keeping my fingers crossed it's my first XC day of the year and I'm going to try and fly to I'm near Uppingham to meet my wife who's up there visiting her mum so that's the plan <laughs> Base is at 27, I like it to be 3 really. Push out to this cloud. Oh, it's just beautiful to be at. Look at that, what a view. Up at 28 now. Base is rising. Five to twelve, still mincing around. Base is still only about two nine probably. But more clouds are opening up and popping up downwind. Yay, three thousand feet. Let everyone catch up. So base is uh, is about three one now, or maybe three two. Okay, I'm going to head towards uh, Marlborough. There's a nice cloud on the way. So we've left the hill, sort of, <laughs> not really, <laughs> only just. I'm with Wes there, Andrew Krasinski. We've decided we're going to go to the east of Bryce Norton. The sky is looking, the sky is looking lovely. Marlborough to our right. We do need to keep on pushing right, but this cloud looks quite nice in front. Oh, this is desperate. Two and a half down. Come on, 
car on you. Done the right thing. I've, I've left the gaggle, they're climbing nicely, but I've decided to push east on my own. Because I know we've still got a lot of east to do. One and a half, 1.7. Better three and a half. Crank it over. Come on, where are you? I'm up at two eight. Let's head towards this stuff. And all of a sudden, I've got a bit of company, which is nice. Hopefully we can get a core and get out of here. Yeah, he's definitely going up better. these guys are but let's try and stick with them oh yes yeah, nice three three and a half thousand feet so far yay that's Ollie down there Wantage. Yeah, wantage down here. Did cut ahead. And do we know who's on the orange one thermaling over wantage? Oh, I've got a li little bit left behind from the gaggle. I went off to where I was sure there would be a climb and there wasn't really. They're all pushing onto the next cloud, a thousand foot higher than me. But I'm in a nice climb now, that's better. Three almost. This is 
Abingdon in front of me. Oxford over there. Almost round the prize Norton. Then we've got a drop zone to get past. Well, I'm right over the old Abingdon airfield. In a very nice climb. Three nine approaching Oxford. Spot a sailplane ahead, circling. Oh, and a PG underneath the cloud, higher up. One meter a second. I don't believe that's the climb there in there. Sweet climb, three meters per second on average. Well, after a lot of mincing, I seem to have found a better climb. Cell plane down there. 1.92. 3,300, so it gained 1,100 feet. Not much wind. 10 to 15 kilometers an hour. Just 
stumbled into a very nice climb. Two four. Very close to the others, but it's difficult to see them. big racetrack. Here's something going round. Making a lot of noise. Come on, what was it? Lip of about two meters here. stumbled into a very nice climb 2.5 metres per second let's get up here it's odd isn't it we have climbs in metres per second but we have height in feet it doesn't make it very easy to do calculations Seeing as that's what the airspace is all in, it sort of makes sense to have it in feet. And yeah, 100k for us of the season. So that's cool. And the time is four o'clock. Northampton up there. Woo! Up at 5,000 feet again. I could join that old trainer glider. If not, nice cloud here. This is Northampton. Ah, oh, what a view. 4,800 over Northampton. So a little aerodrome there that's got an ATZ sidewell, uh, which I'm having to keep clear of. Seems a massive distance to pass it. You can 
considering there's nothing flying in and out of it. I'm hoping to get a climb, but I'm down to two and a half thousand feet now. Oh, this is bad. Down at 1600 feet. Cloud, no clouds above me. And airspace to my right. Down at 1300 feet, less than a thousand above the ground. You never know though. Very close to the ATZ. now I wouldn't be able to stick with it seven hundred and fifty above the ground I'm past the ATZ now come on landing fields now. hundred feet This is really his last chance saloon. I think this is the end of the road. Ah, oh, what a lovely flight. Ah. ah well that was a lovely flight um slow five and a bit hours in the air but um yeah 129k straight line 135 with wiggles didn't quite make my goal landed somewhere north of northampton <laughs> um yeah pack up and uh start hitching we're in northampton Ah, uh, right. Today, so we're over there. <laughs> uh, I flew right over Northampton at 5,000 feet. <laughs> so, what are your names? I'm just filming, by the um, way, because I make a YouTube film of my right. flights. That's John and I'm Agnes. John and Agnes, thank you very much. I'm Tim. And these kind folk are giving me a lift to, towards Corby. Um, or maybe on the outside somewhere, one of the petrol stations. Ah, that saves a bit of a walk. <laughs> Uh, you can't you can't beat it but it is pretty mad sport you know you take off from a hill and have no just end up in the middle of nowhere what other sport lets you do that <laughs> if you go cycling you normally have a destination or you do a big loop i suppose hot air ballooning but oh. you always have a land rover or something coming to pick you up <laughs> cross-country paragliding is it's pretty mad <laughs> thank you ah i've just had a great lift from a couple called john and agnes they give me a lift all the way to uh, the top of Rockingham Hill. So 
on the home straight now. This is the village of Rockingham and it has a very fine castle sort of up there um, which I've never been to but I'm told it's fine. Um, yeah so Lisa's coming to get me and there's a pub down here. Cheers. Only half because Lisa's uh, only about five minutes away. Oh, what a great day. And here we are at Lisa's mum's house. I have landed here once before, but uh, not this time. 25k short still. Didn't take too long to get here. All oh, right, time for a beer. Another one.